Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a great day today. So for today's video, I'm going to be opening my very first glossy box with you guys. I have been wanting to get um, some kind of subscription box for a while now. And truthfully, the person who got me onto like really, really wanting a subscription box is her YouTube is Slayer Rose. I'll link it down in the description because her videos are amazing, especially her Lush Bath Bomb ones. Love them. But yeah, I'll leave her link to her channel down below in the description. But she's the one that really got me into like subscription boxes. She opens hers like every month, I believe. And do you know what? I was like, do you know what? It's such a nice treat. You don't really know what you're gonna get. So I thought I really, really want one. So after watching her video, she enticed me in, you know, and I set up my own subscription box. So if you guys enjoy this video, let me know in the comments down below so that I know to do these like continuously. Um, make sure you leave a like as well because that really, really helps. And let's just get on with the unboxing. Now for the bit that we've all been waiting for. So this is my glossy box. I'm actually so excited, you know, like I feel like a kid because I have no idea what's in it. First impressions of the box, by the way. I thought these boxes were bigger. Like this looks like quite a small like Diddy box. Not that that means anything about like the products inside or anything. I don't know what it was. When I used to watch the videos, I just thought the boxes like looked bigger. The box is actually, it's not teeny tiny, but it's just smaller than what I thought. And when we take the lid off, if I can. Oh, so that's cute. It all just comes wrapped up. And I can already smell something in there, <laughs> I'm pretty sure. So it just comes all wrapped up like this, which is super cute. Kane actually went to take a sneak peek at this earlier. I wanted to wait and put my like first impression reaction out with you guys kind of thing. Um, but he actually opened it to try and see what was inside it. And then he seen that it was like, he said it was not at all, so he didn't want to open it because he thought it was cute. So he left it. So even he doesn't know what's in here. So let's go ahead and open this. And then once you take that off, it's just got your little glossy box logo sticker here on the paper. And then here are all of our little products that I just nearly threw on the floor. <laughs> oh yeah, I should probably, um, I'm in my pajamas again. I feel like this is becoming a recurring thing. I'm just not really getting ready. Like I get up, I brush my teeth, I wash my face. I change my pajamas, but that's about it. <laughs> so I'm not really getting ready, ready, you know? But um, yeah, just thought I'd address that. I love my dressing gown. What can I say? I love to sit in it. So the first product is this coconut milk and organic honey. What actually is it though? Oh, it's a hair mask. I actually, I love hair masks, just saying. So it says quenches and controls frizz for all curl types, hydration and definition. Cool. It's a curl care deep conditioner. Wow. I'm guessing this is because I've um, put like my skin type and hair type and stuff on there. I wonder whether I should take that off so I get products that I personally wouldn't usually buy, if that makes sense. But this is actually a really good idea. I can't wait to use this. I love hair masks. And although my hair is straight, it's actually naturally quite curly. Um, so that will come in handy for me. So the next product, product. <laughs> the next product we have in here is the Avant Rose Papaya Vitamin B Proline Alanine Papaya. I don't know what that just said. It's an age nutri revive, gentle rose beautifying face exfoliant. Ooh, nice. It's a 50 milliliter. It says gently massage a small amount into the skin after cleansing, then rinse the skin thoroughly with lukewarm water. Okay, cool. Oh, this is also vegan and cruelty free by the looks of it. Cool, cool. Oh, it has a little tab on it, so I can't smell it yet, but I actually can't wait to put that to good use and give that a go. I usually don't use ex like exfoliating products because um, they usually have like beads in and stuff and I they can damage your skin. So hopefully that's just um, really gentle. Oh, this is that Rituals brand. 
that I have the little card for. But that's a really good idea though, because it gives you 20% off. So if I liked this, I could repurchase it for 20% off. That's cool. So this is the rituals, the ritual of Sakura, Sakura, I don't know. Celebrate each day as a new beginning, softening rice scrub, organic rice milk and cherry blossom. So this is again a exfoliant. Also, this is for like whole body exfoliant, cool. So I don't know how long this would last me because it's like a 70 milliliter bottle, which is quite big, but obviously to do your full body, I don't know how long that would actually last for, but it gently removes dead skin cells, apply to the body scrub to damp skin, um, rinse with warm water, and that's basically all it says and then it just has its ingredients so i can't wait to give that a go i don't mind using scrubs on my body because no one wants to have like dead skin just laying on the body you know so the next thing we've got is a nails ink nail varnish i've actually really been getting into nail varnish lately and this looks like such a pretty just spring summer color so i actually can't wait to try this out i've been really trying to like pamper my nails a little bit Again, this is vegan and cruelty free. Um, and it's called Blossom Kisses, I believe. I think that's the name of it. I could be wrong though. But yeah, I can't wait to give that a try. Okay, and then the last thing in the box is the Sport Effect Raspberry and Rhubarb Recovery Lip Balm. Oh, nice. I wanted to try Sport Effects for a while, like this sponge, loads of people like raved about it. So I can't wait to try something by them because I actually meant to go and buy it. So it says it contains vitamins C, E and F, natural ingredients, it's SPF 15, paraben free, vegan friendly and cruelty free. We love that. So it also says sumptuously scented and silky smooth, our iconic raspberry and rhubarb lip balm is almost good enough to eat. A sweep over lips leaves a still kiss of color while shea butter and almond oil nourish to nourish the perfect pout. What's more, our hero balm is enriched with SPF 15 and a triple vitamin complex to keep lips protected and perfected. Let's see if we can give this a sniff. Oh cool, it comes in a little like, you know them EOS lip balm things? Oh my god, that smells so good. It doesn't smell strong, like it's not got a strong smell, but the subtle smell of it is lovely. It just smells like raspberries, really. It smells lovely. I've already got lip balm on, otherwise I'd give this a go right now. But um, I already have lip balm on, so there would literally be no point. But I can't wait to give that a try. Cool. And I feel like this box would actually be quite handy to keep too, because it's quite sturdy, you know? I'm one of them people where I hoard everything. Like, I keep everything. I've still got, like, my um, birthday boxes and, like, boxes that Soap and Glory stuff come in. So, super cute. Okay, so those were all of the products that I got in my first glossy box. Safe to say, I'm really, really happy with everything that I got and I can't wait to try everything out. The things I'm most excited to try out are the um, coconut milk hair mask, this lip scrub, and probably the nail varnish because I've just really been into that lately. So, yeah, I can't wait to try those ones out. Um, I can't wait to try everything out to be honest so I'm really really glad that I started this subscription because it just gives you something to look forward to every month I think it's a really really good idea and it's only £10 so that's really really not a lot of money at all I don't even feel like you can get like a nail varnish and like I don't know what was this again like a face exfoliant for £10 usually so straight away I feel like you're, like, you're saving money instantly if that makes sense but yeah, I'm really happy with everything that I got. Let me know if you guys have a Glossy Box subscription and whether you're happy with like your experience and stuff like that. I'd love to know. Let me know if you guys do want to see more Glossy Box unboxings. This was obviously just my first one. I'm sure as I go on, I'll get better at them. <laughs> but yeah, I feel like this is fun. Like I get to share my excitement with you, you know? It's like a surprise for me and you. But yeah. Um, hopefully you guys really enjoyed this video let me know in the comments down below what videos you would like to see me film next um, and I'll get onto that as quickly as I can for you give this video a thumbs up and a comment if you did enjoy 
Don't forget to subscribe if you do want to see a little bit of more, a little bit of more, okay Lana, a little bit more of me. <laughs> so don't forget to subscribe before you go. Thank you guys so much for joining me until the end of this video. I love you guys and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. I literally think I said guys about 15 times in that outro. Okay, now I really need to drink my tea.